Ah. Okay. I accidentally turned off my mic. That's funny. Also, why is... I don't get why I have the sound so high in this game. Shouldn't be that loud to begin with. Okay. Back into the milkman conspiracy. <clears throat> I am the milkman. My milk is delicious. So... I need a plunger. Try and remember how I do that. How did I miss this guy? Oh. I am the milkman. My milk is delicious. So then... Oh, I can hear him. I'm trying to figure it out. How to progress. I don't remember how to progress. Oh. I know I need the plunger. I know I need to get in that building. sure I have to get in the building in order to get the plunger. Pretty sure that's the thing. Question is... I don't remember how to do it. I didn't remember! Got it. Oh. <laughs> 
Work in the sewers. So confusing. All right. What the fuck? Oh, it's a nightmare. How wonderful. Wait, 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 wait. Loud lady. Sewer worker. Nice to meet you. They got Freddy. Poor Freddy. He was such a good secret agent. I mean, assassin. Who is shooting at us? That's not good. My motivations are clear only to myself. I'm worried the other assassins are gonna make fun of me. Watch out, fellow assassin. There seems to be someone shooting at us from that tower. Oh, you know what? Let me guess, I have to get... Fueled? Or invisibility. Slot this. I'm worried the other assassins there are gonna to be make fun of me. Shooting at us from that tower. Shield worked. Okay. Mental cobwebs. What is up here? Freeze! Don't come any closer. I'll never tell you the location of the milkman. Never! Okay, let's all just settle down and talk. Ah! Where is the milkman? 
Who is the Milkman? What is the mission of the Milkman? Oh my I god. Never any of those. Hmm. The view from up here is pretty good, but I still can't see enough. I need a way to get even higher. Like super high. As if I were flying. I know. Maybe I could find some stilts. As the helicopter keeps losing past behind. Stop, helicopter! Land and let me in. I want to see the view from up there, please. pilot uh -huh. I like to fly helicopters we are looking for the milkman we don't know where he is helicopters can go up and down man these guys are dumb hey wait What's that? I'll bet that's him. The milkman. Looks a whole heck of a lot like Boyd. Helicopters move sideways too, but not as fast as planes. He's on that remote island over there. What the heck is that sound? Oh, no. Hello? Who is the milkman? Boy, is this you? I think I found the milkman. I have no idea what you're talking about. Who is this? Okay, from now on, your name isn't Boyd. It's Royd. Because you're such a big pain in my butt. If you see a lady tossing her cookies, run away. That's a little funny, but only a little. Okay, I need to get the gun out. It's fake. I'm worried the other assassins are gonna make fun. My motivations are clear only to myself. Adjustments need. I am a skilled phone repairer. Damn it! Another nightmare! Skilled phone repairer. Come work on the phone lines with us. I can climb telephone poles. Is there anyone on the line? What the fuck? Game's just like, nope, bump off. Off our telephone lines. Like, what? I don't get it. I am a skilled phone Come work on the phone lines with us. Never. Never! Okay. Boink.
Oh, fuck's sake. And yet another life lost to me not pressing the jump button at the right time. Just oof. Trying to go through is buggy repair. as shit. I do not kill out of passion, but for money. Come work on the phone lines with us. Can you hear me? Someday, the popularity of mobile phones will make my job obsolete. You think, right? There were secrets in this backyard. Wait a minute, haven't not gotten all the baggage? Oh fuck. Wait. Wait, at least I have I'm missing a tag. How'd that happen? Oh whatever. Forgot I need Ah They're coming Better not be that creepy guy again. Who is it? Oh fuck, it's gonna just recharge. God damn it. Oh shit! Oh, hello there! Have you come to pay for your rainbow treats? We knew you would. Won't you join us in our rainbow squirt pledge of purpose? To promote niceness. To make the world prettier. To share candy with everyone. To obfuscate the true nature of the milkman. To protect the milkman at all costs. you not to follow. Now you must die! But that is the way of the rainbow squirts! Godzai! Ha! Um... Treats for you! Die! Hi Wait. 
point. Ah. Alright, lady, come on. Wait, I can just shoot her. Duh. Ow. Clairvoyance, dear den mother. Again, clairvoyance, dear den mother. Ha, so simple. I'm not going to explain it for a third time. Now die. Exactly. I am the milkman. My milk is delicious. And the sea shall run white with this rage. I am the milkman. My milk is delicious. Special delivery today. I am the milkman. My milk is delicious. Boyd? Are you okay? Time for the final delivery to this address. Hey, is that milk regular kind? Or the exploding dream kind? It's fortified with what the world wants. What the world deserves. Are you sure you don't want to just talk about this, Boyd? Oh boy. So we're back in the waking world. Look at that. Our rank just went up by 10. Oh my god, somebody's brain! Don't worry, Frankie. I'll put this one right next to Kitty's. Yes! I got a brain! Finally! Now your ears won't whistle so much when the wind blows. <laughs> no, I meant I recovered a stolen brain. Oh, I know what you meant. Sheesh! You and Sasha. No sense of humor when you're on a mission, hmm? Well, are you gonna come back here so we can recranialize that noodle while it's still al dente? No, because we're gonna go find other ones, too. Like, uh, this one. JT's brain? This little doggy get out of the pen. All right, let's look around, shall we? Hey, look, a card. Oh, another brain. Kitty's brain. You know, I hate to say it. But it is better groomed than the rest of the brains. Thank you, all of you. You're all so kind. You make a girl so happy. Hey. 
I don't think it's healthy to be talking to random pots, lady. Ah, the front entrance is supported. Ah, that's why you have to walk past Crazy Lady. Got it! is on the run. This is our moment of glory. Oh, shut up, you loon. The battle can't be won. We're gonna lose it. I'm afraid you lost it years ago, Fred. Now pipe down over there. I am the orderly, and I run a quiet, peaceful, insane asylum. Understood? <laughs> oh, now, see? You've disrupted Mr. Tagley's art therapy session. Ha <laughs> ha! de gloire est arrivé! Whatever. Okay, uh, uh, everybody who's still in the army, please raise your hands, unless you're dead. Oh, great. You ruined everything. Now I lost. You are losing anyway. Oh, just shut up and let me pout alone, will ya? I want to play again! Brain! Chaps, what is up, eh? What the fuck? Give me my cards. Give me another brain. Give him a loose brain and a kale ASAP so we can protect him. Ah, good move, man. Chloe sneeze this one through that helmet will never know. Uh. All right, let's see here. Got the card. And this is the I'm point. I'm gonna run now. Where I run back. Camp and get some extra help. Is it? Oh, it's why. My brain is so dead. <clears throat> Hello, Linda. What's up, Linda? Prepare yourself for passage, human child. Sanctuary. Rasputin, come up here. There's something you should see. Okay, before I go up there.
You break that equipment? Cards. Left, son. Can't even make a connection with Sasha or Mia right now for some reason. Sasha said he had some official Psychonauts business. Impossible. I would know it if they did. No, something's happened to them. Rasputin, listen. They're the only one who can stop Oleander now. What about you? I... I can't leave this cave, Rasputin. Not as the Ford Crawler you know. What? Why? Years ago, I was in a terrible psychic duel that left me barely alive. Yeah, I read about that. They said your psyche was shattered, that you lost your mind. But you seem fine to me. Yes, when I'm down here near the Sartanium Motherlode. The concentrated power of the Sartanium pulls my thoughts together, keeps me like my old self. But if I leave this sanctuary, my psyche becomes disjointed, and I'll fall into one of my other personalities with no memory of who I really am. I'd be no use to you unless you needed something raked or, or mopped. Well, you can call headquarters and get help. The Psychonauts won't listen to me. They wrote me off as a loon years ago. That's why Sasha and Mia have to take on all my missions. Headquarters doesn't know I'm the one behind the assignment, so they'd never get approved. But Sasha and Mia seem to be out of commission now. You have to be my field agent, Rasputin. Are you ready? Yes. Good. You have to find where that monster took the girl. And if you locate any of the other children's brains along the way, bring them back to me for recranialization. Understand? Ew. I mean, yes, sir. But I have brains. Well, the good thing about you finding that kid's brain, besides the whole thinking and feeling they'll be able to do now, is that they will be adding their subconscious mental attention to your quest, and their energy will increase your mental health potential. That sounds great. But is the surgery going to be dangerous? Nothing's dangerous when you have the right tools. Messy, yes, but not dangerous. And so that's why, even though she is a girl, and we are good friends, she is not technically my girlfriend. Well, I can tell you one thing. My dad is never going to send me to this camp again. Where's Kitty? Never mind. I'll find her. So, as you can imagine, we are in some bad trouble. Sounds like it's time something bad happened to our fine coach. Well, let me tell you what our plan is. Please, you have your plan, I have mine. But say no more. And so, long story short, we're hoping for the best, but preparing for the worst. Well, there's only one thing that can make this better. Pedicure. See ya. The end. Okay, here's the plan. I'm gonna go get on the coach's radio and call for help. See, now that's an excellent idea. Why can't everyone be so helpful? Yeah, I modified the antenna, so now it broadcasts straight into outer space. Oh, man. And that's why we need your help more than anybody's. Well, shut my mouth. I better go patrol the living quarters, guard the women folk and all. Say, is my hombre walking around yet? Not yet. But soon, I just hope he forgives me for acting like such a dang fool. And that's why finding your brain in particular was my highest priority. You know, I'll bet if JT wasn't so distracted, this wouldn't have happened. 
He's probably with that prissy little show pony right now. No. Actually, I think her mind's on other things at the moment. Hmm. Well, maybe I'll go see what's up. One of us at least should be guarding the sleeping quarters. Uh. Agent Crawler? What is the current situation? I'd better go. go. Lots of work to do. Good luck, Rasputin. Alright. So, we currently... Wait a minute. Lily! <gasps> well, I've reviewed your chart, little girl, and the bad news is we're gonna have to remove your brain. Strap it into an armored battle tank and make it shoot down innocent civilians with its concentrated psychic death beam! I'm gonna kill you so much! The good news is that your insurance is gonna cover the whole thing. So, hey, is it getting warm in here? No, I'm just trying to set you on fire through this stupid hat. What a delightfully mean little brain you have. Just what we want. Here, do me a favor. Tell me if you think this smells like... Your doom! <laughs> I can't smell anything. Curses! <laughs> uh, you're a stubborn little ball of flame, ain't you? Well, that head cold won't protect you forever, little girl. And when it's gone, you'll be sneezing a different tune. A tune in the key of... Brains! <laughs> well, that's great, you know. Ah, <clears throat> uh, it's so great. Yep, mm hmm Boing. Okay, boing. Boing. Where would you like me to take you, Agent Crawler? Uh... To the lake. the lake! Yes, to the lake. Adio, sir. <clears throat> Why, hello there, Longfish. What's up, Linda? Prepare yourself for passage, human child. Okay. Grab me by the head, bitchy. Okay. I have the power. Okay, so I guess, I guess, we should dive into the brain of this lady over here. Oh, if you don't like the performance, a simple boo will do. Soleil got stage fright and locked herself in her dressing room. 
So now we're stuck flipping between sunshine shenanigans and the horror of Hagatha Home. Oh. Which is like flipping between a root canal and a sharp stick in the eye. Just ignore Jasper. He's just a critic. Who happens to be right. I'll go talk to Benita. I'm sure all she needs is a little pep talk. That and acting lessons. You can get Benita to take the stage again. And you're the star of my show, kid. Okay. First off, 